Hey everybody, it's TK here. TK here, nurse girl, my Baruto Naruto next generation episode 4. Tell about the sexist review or thoughts, whatever you want to call it. So, of course, it's boys versus girl, according to the title. Uh, this all started when Konohama was shown off the salmon and jutsu, and Baruto tries to show off and do the salmon and jutsu, and of course, it fails. The girls start talking about him, of course. But the real argument started when Baruto. Shikadai, you know, Jin and Wabi and Dinky was talking about the animals they wanted to summon, which is like things that pretty much grossed out the girl, like a spider or a frog or a snake, something like that. And that's pretty much the first argument that had started it all. The second argument came when Baruto and Shigurada was trying to buy the same food item, and Chojo, which is Choji's daughter, pretty much bought up all the food. And um, Baruto, I believe, you know, Jin was trying to get. Chocho to share and Baruto they was like pretty much arguing with her while that's going on Shirada buys the last item Naruto gets mad start arguing uh, Shino comes and says you can handle this at the school pretty much sets up an obstacle course at the school Rory gets to the top of the school and gets the flag when it was boys versus girl uh, they showcase the moves of the characters that we pretty much already knew about which is Inojin Super Beast Scroll, we got Chocho, Super Expansion Jutsu, and Shidai, which is the uh, Shadow Possession, Shadow Paralysis Jutsu, all that stuff, you know. Um, and they talked about Wabi a little bit. We know Wabi is not related to any of the characters from um, Naruto. So he's just, he's like this new character, fresh, but they talked about him a little bit. Uh, Moa, I really enjoyed the episode, pretty good episode. Uh, towards the end of the episode, Naruto was in this um, scroll. I mean, that's in Naruto. I mean, Baruto. Baruto was in, in the scroll room, and uh, he took one of the scrolls and was uh, going to do a, a summoning jutsu. Uh, this is at the point where it's just Baruto, uh, Inojin, and Shidai, because all the other boys pretty much dropped out of the condition, basically. Um, uh, Inojin and Shidai was pretty much going to be decoyed as Baruto tries to get to the top of the roof from outside and that's when Baruto takes a scroll uh, the girl ends up blasting through the door this right like at the roof and Baruto summons this spider and it's really huge and he sees it has this sinister chakra which is what he has been seeing on Dinky with that first episode and uh, Mel Lee on the third episode I believe and uh yeah he ends up instead of going for the flag he ends up trying to save Chocho because Chocho was she just got blasted away by this spider that Baruto ended up summoning um and Shirada comes to help as well Konoharu comes down with the Rasengan takes out the beast the spider thing and this after everything has been settled you no know, uh the purple hero character uh, we don't know her name, but it's just this character that seems like a Hinata type character. Seems like she likes Baruto too. But um, she picks up the flag, and because it was, I guess, the flag got blown away right where she was at. So she takes the flag, and they pretty much win. And towards the end of the episode, we see Urchimal standing on top of a building. And I'm guessing that scroll that now, that scroll that Baruto had took, summoned. Somehow he summoned um, him there. Um, we don't really know exactly how he is, how he was made. Um, he's a virtual son. I don't know. I don't know his name. But I forgot to pronounce it. I know it starts with him, but uh, we don't know how he was pretty much made. I'm guessing he was one of Rochimaru's lab experiments, I guess. And just like that's his son, uh, and he did. I don't know where I heard it from, but I heard no that Orochimaru was like, he's not a male or female. I forgot where I heard it from. It was on one of the episodes. But, uh, yeah, really looking forward to seeing more of this uh, character. I've got a name, but on the movie, he seemed like a pretty cool character. I like, I seem to like him. Um, but, but yeah, looking forward to the next episode. It's called Mysterious Transfer Student. Baruto is going to meet him for the first time. Let's see how this first kind of go. They're going to be rivals or they're going to be buddies. We're going to see. But anyways, I'm TK. TK Doris Car. Thanks for tuning in. Tweet me on Twitter. 
we can continue the conversation there. I'm going to talk more about Baruto. Uh, leave comments down below. Tell me what you want to see on the Baruto series. What you want? What you predict or what, what you want to see happen? Um, what I want to see, person, I want to see more of other characters. We um, we don't got too much girl guys. We got Shirada and Chocho. And on the boys' sides, we got Baruto, we got Shaddai, we got Inojin. Then we got Awabi and Dinky. We don't know who. I mean, they're not um, kids of the main character, but they're like these new characters that we've been introduced with. And I like Awabi, by the way, too. But um, it seems like we might. The third girl that may be like a character is the purple haired character which is like the Hinata type character uh, it seems like she's not she likes Boruto as well but I'm hoping that we get uh, Baruto and Shirada I hope they become a couple in the future on the series but yeah on TK two those cards there's a two on there like I said two on three I'm gonna continue the conversation and uh, until next time I'll talk to you later peace